it's Karis and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I am doing something very, 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 very exciting right now. And I am out of breath from walking up the hill to my barn. But speaking of my barn, I am renovating it. We're actually uh, expanding it, adding on, doing a barn raisin. And I'm super excited. It's been almost seven years since we built the original and I am so excited to be adding on to it. I've been wanting to do this for a couple of years and we're basically uh, making it three times as big as it is now. So we're adding, expanding quite a bit onto it, but I want I drew up a little bit of a blueprint thing to show you guys, which I will show you to sort of give you an idea of what we're doing. And I'm not an artist or a drawer or an architect, but you can sort of see, get an idea of what I'm trying to accomplish with uh, expanding my barn. Okay, so here is the blueprint, <laughs> blueprint uh, <laughs> that I drew up. And as you can tell, I have absolutely horrible handwriting and cannot draw. So y'all are gonna enjoy this, but you can see what I'm doing anyway. So um, this bit here is uh, what it is what it is right now. And so this is my current tack room and then this is the current stall that I have. And so all of this is what I want to add on to it. Um, and I drew this one first and then I changed it up because I liked uh, this version of it better. So the stalls are across from each other and then there's posts here that I can add cross ties to because I don't currently have cross ties and that would be really nice. So, uh, so that's what we're going to do. And then my current tack room, which is this one, is going to, which is over here, um, I'm going to turn into the feed room because it's on the outside and this is outside the fence and so the horses can't break into it because that would be terrible. And then we're going to build another tack room identical to it across from it. Um, and so this is where all my tack is going to be, uh, like my saddles and my grooming equipment, um, bridles, halters, etc, etc. And then all the feed will be over here and I'll be able to keep probably five or six hay bales in this room because currently I keep them down in a different building and then I have to haul them up there. Uh, two or three times a week and so I'll probably only have to haul hay once a week now which will be awesome and then we'll have two enclosed stalls because right now it's just kind of a, a run-in thing and so I can lock a horse in there in a pinch but it's not the easiest thing in the world to do um, so we'll actually have two stalls now uh, here and here and um, with little doors and then they'll actually work as stalls and you can actually lock them in there and then they'll have this nice big walkway in the middle that will be covered so if it's raining I can still do stuff with my horses um, or the farrier can come out and trim their feet and my thought is that I could also put it I'm gonna have a gate here already and I could put also put a gate on this side so that this third um, spot in the middle of the walkway could actually become a third stall so I could have a horse here say Bucky um, and then a, a different horse here, and then I could put Scotty in the walkway for a third stall if I needed it. Okay, so I'm going, this is going to be like part one of this video, just to show you guys what we did yesterday on my barn. Uh, we put this all up yesterday, it was a really hard day's work, and uh, my arms are quite sore today. I want to show you guys what we did yesterday, and hopefully get this done rather quickly, because it is starting to rain, and I don't want to have my camera out here in the rain. So, uh, let me just show you guys what we did. So, this is of course the old barn. Everything that has metal on it is my old barn, which you guys will recognize. But walking in here, you can see we've got lumber on the ground. And if you guys recognize the blueprint, that is my old barn. And then we're going to have this aisle way in the middle. And then everything from the aisle way over here to the right is going to be the new portion of the barn. So we're going to have two stalls. We have this one right here, which you can see we put up the wood paneling on the inside of the stall so Bucky won't uh, kick it out. And where the post is, is where the door is going to go. And it's about four feet wide. So pretty, pretty good opening. And we put up a brand new post over here on my old barn as well because we're going to have that opening there too. That gate is going to get, actually the silver gate here is going to be moved down here to the end, right there. Um, and the green gate, I think, is just leaving. So get rid of that. And then this is going to be where the new tack room is going to go. So all my saddles and everything else, like I said, 
is going to go in here. And then my old tack room is on the end here. And that's where all the feed and stuff is going to go. And then behind me is my round pin, which I leave there. And I put Bucky in the round pin at night when it's not raining. But when it is raining, he will have his own brand new stall, which will be very exciting. Uh, but as you can tell, uh, we just kind of got everything framed yesterday. And today we have to, uh, if it quits raining, um, we have to put the wall up where the stall is. Um, so we can close that off. And of course we have to do the metal on the outside. And uh, we need to do the rafters and the roof because that has to come to a point. So we have to build that as well. But you can see the outline of my barn, which is really, 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 really exciting. I'm so excited about this, guys. Oh, I cannot express how excited I am. Uh, the stalls themselves are just going to be so, so stinking nice that everybody will actually have their own stall. And it's going to be really, really nice to have this covered walkway. So that I can still do stuff with my horses when it rains. Because right now, I can't do anything with them when it rains. Um, I mean, I can come in here and stand in the stall. Uh, but that's about it. So, now I'll have this whole big area that I can do stuff in the rain. Or the farrier can come out in the rain. Um, and it's just going to be really, really nice. So, I'm so excited about this. Uh, I hope you guys got a decent idea of what I'm trying to do. And I hope you guys are excited too. I can't wait. Hopefully the rain goes away and we can work on it more today because um, there's really just sort of little things here and there to do like put up cross ties, do the, the stall walls which are going to go halfway up, um, the roof obviously, but there's not that much more to do. So that is part one of this video and I'll be posting updates as we build my barn. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.